today's office set is from Lukin and I also did my nails. This is Lukin's lace tube top. I know like there's waterproof quality materials, but, but I can't get you out of my head. Remember the last video I did? I'm so done with feeling like that, so I'm really excited for back to school. I did my nails yesterday. It only took me two hours and just a little few more minutes, which is quite quick. And I think I have improved doing my nails over the time. This is a holy grail product that has been sent to me. I love it. It's a um, sun stick. It gives such a nice base for makeup. The makeup sticks very nicely, but um, you really do have to powder up the face. I was looking for a stronger coverage foundation because mine are always medium coverage. I don't mind that, but recently I've been wanting that full glam, like slay queen type of look. So uh, I was looking for a higher coverage foundation and I think this does the job. It's not too glam, it's not too heavy. So, and it's also a cushion foundation. Korean makeup products don't tend to have super high coverage, but their shade range is shitty. Let's hope I get to find another cushion foundation that's that's almost that works the same or either just a foundation that's better. But for now this would do because this is something I got for free. And I know I sound like I'm complaining a lot about my life, but this is just how I speak. <laughs> These are a pair of contacts from a local brand called iMuse. I love talking to their marketing team. <laughs> I love chatting with them, it's so nice. And they just sent me this and I wish they could send me more but I don't want to be greedy. I can buy it, I can buy it. This is the shade Robin Grey. I love it so much that I posted uh, an Instagram photo wearing these. All the things I mentioned just now are not sponsored, they are just things I love on a daily basis. fried rice and I'm gonna pair it with seaweed. I'm bringing extras for my friends and also for my boyfriend. Um, they are all we are all in the same school so I can just bring it to them.
is my look for today. I went for ribbons and pigtails because my hair is oily. And today I just want to bring a small bottle to school. I bought these two from Taiso on TikTok shop and the caps are changeable and they are the same size so I just switched the two. Here's today's outfit. I have a marketing class and an audio visual class so I was not really feeling like the baddie um, main character energy today so we went for a cuter look, a much more subtle look which I can just chill. This is the whole outfit. These are cargo pants from Lukin and also a t-shirt in this cutting which I really like. This is my first time wearing a t-shirt with a cutting like this and I really like it. I wanted to bring Bibble to class but he's too big so we're not gonna bring him so just stay here. I put on a necklace as well as a ring over here and then two rings over here as well. Class yesterday was very fun. I really like going to school. I don't know if you can relate. I love going back to class and I love just enjoying what I do because uh, in high school, my advice for people who want to go to uni, pick what you love. You will enjoy every single bit of it. It's your passion. You will make a way to make a living out of it. So, yeah. Wise words from cons. This is my outfit for today. This is a set from Lukin but I did not wear it with the matching pants because they were too tight on me. So this is the set that I'm wearing. The pants are way too tight on me so I couldn't wear it so I paired it with um, another dress from Lukin instead. Obviously this is a little revealing for school. I mean I could just wear it but I don't feel too comfortable wearing this just like this to school so there is a long sleeve outerwear for this set so I'm gonna go grab it I think I saw Tracy um, Sarang Ho on YouTube wearing this set so I just really wanna try it out and I really love her finished class, I feel like grabbing a sandwich at a cafe and take away. I went and got donuts at the gas station. There's donuts so 
I got a sandwich and then I also got half a dozen of donuts. I've never tried Dunkin' sandwiches, but this is my first time and it looks good. So this is the sandwich that I got. It's it's humongous, so let me just take a bite. This is today's outfit. I really like this one. I wore this to my dance class um, in the last two weeks. But yeah, um, these are the pants that I talked about, which feel too tight on me. I mean, everything looks good here, but it looks great. But I could not button this. It's just too tight on here, and it's kind of long, so I might get it tailored. I'm using this Dior foundation sample. It's so good, but I have another sample from Dior before, which is also the same, but uh, in the matte version, and it was perfect on my skin, but this thing's too expensive for a full size, so I don't think I'll be getting any soon, but uh, if you're a makeup sponsorship, and if you have good foundation, please send me PR. This just looks so stunning on the skin. It just looks so flawless, see? But the only downside is that I have to use a really matting powder because um, the weather here is so humid and I can't go on a day without using a matte powder. Like, just look at the finish. It's so natural and it doesn't make my pores look humongous. I know the difference. I have tried a few foundations, so yeah, this is this is actually so good.
I just came back home from the mall. I felt I felt lonely for a bit, so I cried. And uh, my boyfriend is not here today, so I wanted to do a haul of what I got from the mall today. Remember when I just mentioned about the Dior foundation earlier today? I went and bought a foundation, but it's not the Dior one. I went and got this, which is the Wet n Wild Matte Foundation because I tried it on my hand and it works well. The finish looks good, so I just went for this. And I also got myself a pack of wet tissue and yam chips. These are extremely good. And I got the Chuan uh, La Wei, which is like the spicy type of mala, Sichuan flavor. So I got this. Yeah. I also got a package from Sigi Skin, uh, which is a brand based in Singapore. I've never tried their products, but they decided to send me their products, so I'm just gonna unbox it. Uh, this is not sponsored, this is for a Xiao Hong Su post, so nothing related. No strings attached on YouTube, I just want to do this for fun. Mm. Oh, look, the packaging is so pretty. This is what they sent over a mist. This is a uh, essence. Oh, oh, I thought it was a mist. Okay, let's see. Mmm, the packaging. Oh, yes, it is a mist and essence mist. So I am in fact not wrong. It is a dew potion. So let's see if it smells good. Mmm, it smells like a sweet. It smells like a place where you go for a spa, like those sweet floral type of spa. It has a sweetie finish. Yeah, I'll be using this later. But yeah, it's time to take my makeup off and take a shower and relax because it's been a long week and... <laughs>